Part one. Listen to the following five dialogues. Choose the best answer. The dialogues will be read twice, and the second time is for you to check your answers. I understand that the art and music section was Sue's duty. What's your responsibility? Well, I have the sports page to do. I bought this two hundred dollar washer at a thirty percent discount. It's a very good washer. I think it's a real bargain. Would you spare some time to go shopping with me tomorrow? Let me check. I'll go to the hospital at eight o'clock and then have a meeting at ten o'clock. Well, I'm available the whole afternoon. Hey, you! Watch out! Where's your head? Walking in front of cars like that? Huh? Ah! Oh, sorry. I mean, thanks. I just received word from my agent that my book is to be published. Isn't it wonderful? Sorry, I was daydreaming about the fame to come and forgot to look at the traffic. I thought it would be fun if we all went to see that new movie downtown. Count me out. I've heard it isn't worth the money. I understand that the art and music section was Sue's duty. What's your responsibility? Well, I have the sports page to do. I bought this two hundred dollar washer at a thirty percent discount. It's a very good washer. I think it's a real bargain. Would you spare some time to go shopping with me tomorrow? Let me check. I'll go to the hospital at eight o'clock. And then have a meeting at ten o'clock. Well, I'm available the whole afternoon. Hey, you! Watch out! Where's your head? Walking in front of cars like that? Huh? Ah! Oh, sorry. I mean, thanks. I just received word from my agent that my book is to be published. Isn't it wonderful? Sorry, I was daydreaming about the fame to come and forgot to look at the traffic. I thought it would be fun if we all went to see that new movie downtown. Count me out. I've heard it isn't worth the money. Part two. Listen to the following five conversations or passages. Choose the best answer according to what you hear. Each text will be read twice. What about for later, for dessert? Definitely, a watermelon. A barbecue isn't a barbecue without watermelon. A watermelon? 
Yeah, it'll get eaten. Don't worry. Hmm. What about ice cream? Ah, you have such a sweet tooth. I know, I know. I'll just add two cartons of ice cream to the list. Okay. Now you go buy those things, and I'll tidy up and get the barbecue started. All right. I'll be back soon. What about for later, for dessert? Definitely, a watermelon. A barbecue isn't a barbecue without watermelon. A watermelon? Yeah, it'll get eaten. Don't worry. Hmm. What about ice cream? Ah, you have such a sweet tooth. I know, I know. I'll just add two cartons of ice cream to the list. Okay. Now you go buy those things, and I'll tidy up and get the barbecue started. All right. I'll be back soon. Joan, do you want to hang out? Yes, I do. I'm at home myself right now with nothing much to do. Me too. What would you like to do? Well, we could go to a movie. Have you seen Shrek too? I have, actually. How about the movie Million Dollar Baby with Clint Eastwood? Hmm. I've seen that too. We could go for a walk in the park. We could, but it looks like it's going to rain soon. Why don't we go shopping? I'd really rather not. I'll be too tempted to buy something. Okay. What else would you like to do? I don't know. Do you want to go bowling at the new bowling alley on First Street? I would love to, but I injured my wrist last week. Let's see. Do you want to go to a bar? That sounds interesting, but I can't drink alcohol with the medicine I'm taking. Joan, do you want to hang out? Yes, I do. I'm at home myself right now with nothing much to do. Me too. What would you like to do? Well, we could go to a movie. Have you seen Shrek too? I have, actually. How about the movie Million Dollar Baby with Clint Eastwood? Hmm. I've seen that too. We could go for a walk in the park. We could, but it looks like it's going to rain soon. Why don't we go shopping? I'd really rather not. I'll be too tempted to buy something. Okay. What else would you like to do? I don't know. Do you want to go bowling at the new bowling alley on First Street? I would love to, but I injured my wrist last week. Let's see. Do you want to go to a bar? That sounds interesting, but I can't drink alcohol with the medicine I'm taking. Hey, Sherry. What are you doing this afternoon? Oh, I have a French class at one thirty. Oh, I thought your major was English. Well, it's an interesting class. I thought it would be interesting to learn French, but now I think it's quite hard and a little bit boring. Maybe you can give it up. Ah,、uh, I think I'd better keep it on. We shouldn't give up easily, should we? Yeah. Hey, how about this? Remember my roommate Jeff? He comes from Paris. Maybe you can ask him for help. Oh, that's great! I'll definitely need his help on that. How about having lunch together tomorrow when you can introduce him to me? Okay, no problem. Thanks a lot. I have to run. It's one fifteen already. See you tomorrow. Hey, Sherry. What are you doing this afternoon? Oh, I have a French class at one thirty. Oh, I thought your major was English. Well, it's an interesting class. I thought it would be interesting to learn French, but now I think it's quite hard and a little bit boring. Maybe you can give it up. Ah,、uh, I think I'd better keep it on. We shouldn't give up easily, should we? Yeah. Hey, 
How about this? Remember my roommate Jeff? He comes from Paris. Maybe you can ask him for help. Oh, that's great. I'll definitely need his help on that. How about having lunch together tomorrow when you can introduce him to me? Okay, no problem. Thanks a lot. I have to run. It's one fifteen already. See you tomorrow. What are you up to? I'm just looking through the ads. I'm looking for a part-time job. Have you seen anything interesting? Yeah, there's this ad for a teaching assistant at a kindergarten. Must enjoy working with small children and be patient and creative. What's the pay like? Um. Oh, it says minimum wage, but that's okay if I like the job. True. What else is there? Here's a job for a full-time sales clerk in a pet store. Oh yeah, it says here no experience necessary, training provided. Duties: feed and clean the animals, provide customer service, and perform other store duties. That might be fun. I love animals, but it's a full-time position, not part-time. Ah. Let's keep looking. Here's one: waiter for an Italian restaurant. Part time, willing to work flexible hours, experience preferred. Well, I worked at a fast food restaurant last summer. I have some experience. Yes, you should go for it. It says you need two references. No problem. I can ask my old boss, Mr. Fry. He'll give me a good reference, and I'll ask my neighbor, Miss Parker, for a personal reference. She's known me for years. Sounds good. There's a phone number here. Give them a call. Okay, I'll do it right now. What are you up to? I'm just looking through the ads. I'm looking for a part-time job. Have you seen anything interesting? Yeah, there's this ad for a teaching assistant at a kindergarten. Must enjoy working with small children and be patient and creative. What's the pay like? Um. Oh. It says minimum wage, but that's okay if I like the job. True. What else is there? Here's a job for a full-time sales clerk in a pet store. Oh yeah. It says here no experience necessary, training provided. Duties: feed and clean the animals, provide customer service, and perform other store duties. That might be fun. I love animals, but it's a full-time position. Not part time. Ah. Let's keep looking. Here's one: waiter for an Italian restaurant. Part time, willing to work flexible hours. Experience preferred. Well, I worked at a fast food restaurant last summer. I have some experience. Yes, you should go for it. It says you need two references. No problem. I can ask my old boss, Mr. Fry. He'll give me a good reference, and I'll ask my neighbor. Miss Parker, for a personal reference, she's known me for years. Sounds good. There's a phone number here. Give them a call. Okay, I'll do it right now. Good morning, everyone, and welcome to our university. I'm Martha Kudro, your guide for today's campus tour. Our university occupies a 33-acre campus in the heart of the city, and we have a smart campus thanks to our investment in IT. There are more than 2,400 student personal computers on site, and the campus is fully Wi-Fi enabled. Today's tour started from the most typical building on our campus, the library. 
Being the tallest building, our library has over 1,200 study areas, 450 computer workstations, and a wealth of learning materials and information services. The library opens from 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. from Mondays to Fridays, 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. on Saturdays, and 10 a.m. to 8 p.m. on Sundays. Located next to the library is the Chapters Cafe. It has recently reopened with new decoration. The opening hours are from 9 a.m. to 7 p.m. from Mondays to Thursdays, 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. on Fridays. On the left of the library is the University Students' Union. There are currently over 60 social and sports clubs available for students to join in. These range from traditional team sports, such as rugby, football, to more extreme activities like skiing and surfing. The university also prides itself on its excellent provision for sports and recreation with a wide range of facilities and services. And that brings us to the sports center of the university, the building that is opposite to the student center right across the road. Currently, the center offers a four-court hall, which is suitable for volleyball, basketball, and football, a three-court hall, which is suitable for table tennis and badminton, and a two-court hall, which is ideal for exercise classes. Good morning, everyone, and welcome to our university. I'm Martha Kudrow your guide for today's campus tour. Our university occupies a 33-acre campus in the heart of the city, and we have a smart campus thanks to our investment in IT. There are more than 2,400 student personal computers on site, and the campus is fully Wi-Fi enabled. Today's tour started from the most typical building on our campus, the library. Being the tallest building, our library has over 1,200 study areas, 450 computer workstations, and a wealth of learning materials and information services. The library opens from 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. from Mondays to Fridays, 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. on Saturdays, and 10 a.m. to 8 p.m. on Sundays. Located next to the library is the Chapters Cafe. It has recently reopened with new decoration. The opening hours are from 9 a.m. to 7 p.m. from Mondays to Thursdays, 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. on Fridays. On the left of the library is the University Students' Union. There are currently over 60 social and sports clubs available for students to join in. These range from traditional team sports, such as rugby, football, to more extreme activities like skiing and surfing. The university also prides itself on its excellent provision for sports and recreation with a wide range of facilities and services. And that brings us to the sports center of the university, the building that is opposite to the student center right across the road. Currently, the center offers a four-court hall, which is suitable for volleyball, basketball, and football, a three-court hall, which is suitable for table tennis and badminton, and a two-court hall, which is ideal for exercise classes.